starting my day, I had to take care of a few things. The battery of wifey's car went to sh**. <sighs> okay. The project that I'm gonna be doing today is I am adding more to this Star Wars sleeve. Which I'm really excited because I'm gonna be able to see how the outer sleeve healed up and I'm adding more to it. I started my day really early so I got hungry hella early. As you already know, I like to make my stencils extremely simple. The less, the better, and the more I see. The amount of colors and light source transitions that it has, it will complement the outer sleeve perfectly. As I'm doing the stencil, I'm also creating a plan on how I'm going to approach it and creating different scenarios in my head of areas that might give me trouble. This will help me prevent that. I decided to split this project in two days because it looks simple, but I know it will mentally get me tired. So this is the piece that we are gonna be doing today. I like world famous, this world famous blue. It's super bright. Déjame le cambio el ritmo esta mañana. Uh oh. Woo! He's fucking soft, bro. Le digo si lo he estado cuidando. Está cuidando la mercancía acá. No he dejado que le pegue el sol, la opción en la mañana y en la noche. Me da felicidad que te estás cuidando porque a veces yo tengo la piel seca. Sí. Seca, seca. De nacimiento y por güey. <risa> Se lo come. De Deja vu. Igual. Todo esto ya pasó en mi vida. Toda esta conversación ya pasó. De Deja vu. Esta madre, neta, me mareé poquito. Creo que mire el futuro. Venga, venga, venga. Mira, 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 mira. mira. Concéntrate. A gusto, papá. Mira nomás. The most important thing for me right now it is getting comfortable with my approach. That way I can navigate a lot easier and efficient. On this part of the project, I gotta be patient. I have to take my time to transition smoothly from my solid black to my bright blue. Oh, hold on, this is my song. I decided to jump all the way to the top so I can start with my bright blue because I want to do it backwards now. I want to start with my brightest color and start transitioning to my black because I felt like it was going to be a lot smoother and better. Adding red, orange, and yellow to my piece has got to be one of my favorite things. It complements any tattoo, and it just looks so sick, my dude. Chera linda, guarachera hermosa. I know I could get this done, but I don't know if I could get this. I believe in you. You believe in me? I, you got this. Give me your powers. Hey, hey, hey. 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 The hand is key in this project, so I gotta make sure I look at every single little detail, make sure that I'm adding the right tones and highlights. I have to make this part of the tattoo stand out, because if I don't, it's gonna look whack. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> cheers. 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 Nice. Julian, cheers. <laughs> all right, all right. So, uh, after eating, I got my energy up. I started thinking a little bit and I said, you know what? I think I should do the background first so I can leave the center for tomorrow because I don't want to waste time doing the background. So, might as well 
call it a day as soon as I'm done with the background. Yes or nay? I changed my mind as soon as I started doing it because I realized that there's a possibility that the next day the whole leg was going to be swollen and I could not afford that. Day two! Oigame, señores, yo a usted nada le puedo servir. Que quizá fue la noche la que te traicionó. Fue el perfume de mi pelo que te cautivó. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah. It's a good stretch. Give me vibes! Energy! Come to my upcoming seminar here. Come to my seminar here in Phoenix, Arizona. On. Come to my upcoming seminar here in Phoenix, Arizona. It's gonna be a three day seminar and I'm gonna be sharing the way I do my cover ups, true grace, and color. Talking on camera is so stressful, my dude. Oh, brutal. As soon as I started tattooing, I realized that I made the right call, which makes me really happy. The skin was a little swollen, but not enough to affect today's session. I'm about to start doing the lips, so I'm just gonna let you enjoy some natural sounds and raw footage. This part of the face was tricky because the tone that he has is like a reddish brown so I had to be very careful on how I was mixing my browns and my flesh tones to make it happen. And to be completely honest, as I was doing it, all I can think about was please trust the process. Don't doubt it. I am beyond happy, beyond excited the way this tattoo turned out. Love the way it just flows with the whole sleeve. I'm just happy. I'm just happy with the outcome. So, God damn, it's 124 in here. I'm burning. <laughs> so with that being said, if you're a tattoo artist, I hope you learned something from this video. And if you're a tattoo enthusiast, I hope you will entertain. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. This is one year healed. But you know they're also okay. details. I know. And then this is what a fresh tattoo looks like. Gonna turn all the way around. Mmm, we just added this new piece. Mmm mmm mmm.